Frog A24 ground. Concealed operator for swing gates. Before installing. Check that the automated parts are in good mechanical order, that the operator is level and aligned, and that it opens and closes properly. Make sure you have suitable mechanical stops. If any pedestrian openings are fitted into the operator, there must also be a, a system to block their opening while they are moving. Make sure that the opening. Automated door or gate cannot entrap. People against the fixed parts of the operator. Dimensions of the gear motor box. This dimensions in millimeters. Laying the corrugated tubes and fitting the junction pits. Dig the box pit front of post. Dig front side the ground for box. This width is 500 millimeters. Dig height of 500 millimeters inside for the box. Dig breadth of 650 millimeters. The digging of pit as same dimensions in the picture. Set up the junction boxes and corrugated tubes. You will need to connect up to the junction pit and drainage tube. The number of tubes depends on the type of system and the accessories you are going to fit. Fitting the foundation box. Fit the box up against the post. Make sure the corrugated tubes and the drainage tube run thought the corresponding holes. Fill the pit with concrete. Level the box with the ground and fit the pin along the same axis as that of the gate's upper hinge. Let's set for at least 24 hours or more. Clean any concrete residue from inside the box. Sixty-seven millimeters or six point seven centimeters. This the gap between wall pillar and hinges of the door. The hinges should same levels with foundation box center pin. Here also same dimensions, sixty-seven millimeters or six point seven centimeters. Lubricate to the foundation box pin, to the latching lever, and to the gate brace. Fit the gate leaf by fitting the upper hinge. Make sure the leaf opens and closes smoothly. Carefully fasten or weld the leaf to the gate fastening brace. Fitting the release. You must apply grease to the release latching lever. For fitting and operation, please check the wording in the corresponding manually. Fit the adjusting screw A to the gear motor arm. Which side to fit the screw depends on the operator's position. Left side view. Right side view. Open the door manually and put gear motor and put screws. Lubricate the transmission, lever and fit it onto the gear motor. Hole and onto the box lever hole. Establishing the limit switch points for opening. Completely open the leaves, their maximum opening is 110 degrees. Loosen the adjusting screw one until it touches the box three. Tighten the nut two 
to lock the screw into position. For closing, completely close the leaves. Loosen the adjusting screw until it touches the transmission lever, two. Tighten the nut to three to lock the screw into position. Connecting to the control panel. Before doing any work on the control panel, cut off the main power supply. Frog A24 gear motors. Wire A, the power supply of motor. Wire B, the opening slowdown wire. Wire C, closing slowdown wire. Came control panel ZL19N, ZL170N. Motor 1. 24 volt DC gear motor with delayed opening. Motor 2. Motor 2 will first open, then motor 2 after delay openings. 24 volt DC gear motor with delayed closing. Motor 1 will first close, then motor 2 after delay closing. Connect motor to control board. Connection of motor 1. Wire a connection. Wire B and wire C connection. Connection of motor 2. Wire a connection. Wire B and wire C connection. Motor wire A, B, and C done. Note. If the gate doesn't open after you give it an opening command, invert cables M to N and RA to RC on the corresponding gear motor. Establishing the slowdown points only for the Frog A24. The opening and closing slowdown starting points are established via a magnetic field. Repeat this slowdown point establishing procedure several times. Until the leaves begin to slow down 500 millimeters from the closing strike. Use the gear motor to open the leaves to about 500 millimeters from the opening end strike. Final operations. Fastening the cover. Rest the cover over the foundation box and fasten it with the supplied screws. Manually releasing the leaf. Fit the key lever into the release lock and turn it counterclockwise. Open the leaf until the end strike. To relock the leaf, take it back to the closing position.